Trotterton. And the jumping quite well, the favourite just fine with Benno the inside. Now a bit of speed wide out, Spirit Ridge going forward. Navajo Peak pretty handy as well, then Major Beal and Wine Glass Bay. Just behind them is Carl Lepore from Torrance Cleveland out very deep in a tricky spot. Manzois up the fence from Alabir, Bois de Jean, Ho Ho Khan, military mission wide. And Mr Waterville had flopped back to a clear last. Spirit Ridge leads inside the 2,000 metres with Navajo Peak striding to second. And the favourite gets leaders back just fine, travelling in third. A length and a half further back, we've got a line of three. Benno the rails from Wineglass Bay and Major Beale is cast a bit deep at this point. Further back to Cleveland, who's three horses out on the outside of Carla Poor, then came Manzois, Torrens on a wide path, further back to Alabir from Bois de Jean, Ho Ho Khan military mission, good gap back to Mr Waterville, taking a while to get into his rhythm back last of all, so Spirit Ridge leads at the 1400, a length on Major Beale, and Navajo Peak now third, <clears throat> a length further back to Just Finer, the odds on favourite into a clear fourth, still over towards the inside, two lengths away to Wineglass Bay, then came the grey Benno on the rails, two lengths Thanks for the back to Cleveland, who slipped in now. One off the fence around Carla Poor. Further back in the field, then to Torrens from Alabir, Manzois. Military mission, Ho Ho Khan, Bois de Jean. And last of all is Mr Waterville, who's really tacked on now. There'd be about 15 lengths covering the Metro field down the side. Spirit Ridge leads at the 800 metres, a half length now. Major Beal, just fine, pushes through into a clear third. In advance of Navajo Peak. Two lengths then to Benno from Wineglass Bay. Torrens off the track. Now, Mr. Waterfield is set alight going right around the field as they race inside the 600 metres. Spirit Ridge, a half in front to Major Beale. Just fine as locked up at the moment in third. Followed them by deeper out. Cleveland pulling out from Mr. Waterfield. He's hit a flat spot. Military mission wide out. The favourite's out now. Spirit Ridge in front and he's just fine going to it quickly. And just fine moves up on the outside of Spirit Ridge and they're well clear from the rest. Just fine and Spirit Ridge inside the 200 metres and a real good stash here Spirit Ridge showing plenty of fight Rachel King driving hard on Just Fine, the favourite ahead in front Just Fine, Spirit Ridge really trying to come back, Just Fine a brave Metropolitan win one it ahead to Spirit Ridge, they gap the rest Carla Poor third, followed by Benno, Cleveland, Barnish on military mission, then Ho Ho Khan further back to Torren Zalabir, Wineglass Boy Bay, then Manzois from Navajo Peak, Major Beal and Mr. Waterville. History's been created here at Ramwick today. It's the Golden Girls. Kathy O'Hara in the Epsom. Rachel King in the Metropolitan. They've won Group 1s together. The punters are cheering here at Ramwick. The odds on favourite, backed as if unbeatable. Just fine. And look who's congratulating Rachel King, the first to do it. Kathy O'Hara, who's just won the Epsom. Well, Just Fine has created an unbelievable impression here in Australia. He's three from three, and he's won the Metrop, Ronnie, with guts and determination. Well, he needed every bit of that guts and determination. You're sitting there curling the mo as they turned for home, and it got hairier and hairier and hairier for the thrill seekers, and into a dollar sixty across the board there on the totes late, and was only a bob of the head. That's as far as he wants to go, but job done, and it is a day for the Golden Girls. And Spirit Ridge, well, oh boy, didn't he give a fight there and made a real race of it. What a ride. That was one of the best Group 1 rides I've seen. Rachel King, she could have been tempted after his last couple of wins and he's been getting sort of out in front and high balling, especially early into the straight, but she just took her time, letting gather up momentum. Yeah, absolute 10 out of 10. I just want to see that moment again when Cathy uh, gives Rachel the knuckles as they uh, pull up over there near the back straight. So it has been a day for the girls and we don't believe this has ever happened where two females have ridden a group one winner each on the same program. Ahead the winning margin, 226.11, 36.3. Ahead the winning margin. And yet another, another feature for Gay and Adrian. Let me just, I kept on telling you that this is their day. Well, Gay Waterhouse makes it nine Metropolitans. Yes, that's right, nine wins in this race. 
But Adrian, congratulations on your first with a wonderful stayer. Yeah, he's, he's, he's fantastic, you know, great to, great to see. He was a spectacular finish, uh, had a real fight on his hands today. Um, so really, really proud of him to fight the way in which he did. And, um, you know, they've just run time hearing that. So, you know, full credit to the second horse. He wouldn't lie down and I was partly worried up the straight, but he, um, he dug very deep. They've broken the track record. Yeah, so they've gone out. Good speed, good, good, good tempo, and you know there was a few question marks over whether he could say that sort of trip today. No doubt the the weight had helped, but you know to, to be running track records, there's got to be pressure on from the outset. So he's he's been able to answer that today. And normally when they run track records, they're doing it all day, but this is a one-off. Yeah, certainly. Um, and and this performance isn't in isolation with him either. He's he's had the three runs in Australia now and, and been you know very very impressive in each of them and, and to get to a group one very, very quickly in such a short time here in, in Australia has certainly been very impressive. What was your first impression of him? He's, he's always stood out for us early days. He's showed tremendous speed, more so than, than most Europeans had coming here. But as I said, the, 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 how quickly he's progressed through the grades has probably taken me a bit by surprise. Yeah. And everyone questioned his 2,400 metre form. It hadn't happened for him over there, but... He's just a different horse, surely. A different horse here. He seems to be thriving under the conditions physically. He looks, he looks great. He's done very well. Um, look, no doubt came here today thinking they would like to make it a test if anyone sort of thought there was going to be a chink in his armour. That would be the, the question that needed to be answered. So we're expecting a strong test. And, you know, Rachel was sort of able to keep her nerve and sort of ride a, a lovely measured race on him. Well, I'm trying to delve into a bit of history here. I know Gay would have done it many times, but how many Group 1 doubles for Adrian Bott? No, I'm not, I'm not sure. That's... Hopefully the, hopefully the first. Yeah, of many. Hopefully. Yeah, it's been a great day. Fantastic. Thank you very much. Well done. Congratulations, Rachel. That was an absolute 10 out of 10 peach ride. Thank you. Um, yeah, look, I just, Spirit Ridge got it pretty comfortable in front, and I was sort of aware that, you know, he's a horse that really does stay, and I, didn't, I wanted to give my bloke as easy a time as possible, but also not give him too much work to do. But uh, luckily, it, once he got his nose in front, he was very tough, and he wouldn't let the other one get back past him. After his first two wins, you could have been tempted to let him roll, get to the front and just let him keep on improving, but suspected the distance, but not today. Not today. He's proven he wasn't today. Um, Gay mentioned to me on the phone this morning that he's, he's English bred, so he, of course he'll stay, and of course she's right. Um, yeah, like I was, we got a beautiful run today, 50 kilos on his back, just getting that suck run. It's the first time he's actually had the opportunity to get a nice cut into it like that, and... It's great to see him let down as well as he did. A bit of history, two girls winning the Group 1 races. Girls are taking over. Watch out. No doubt. <laughs> well done. Thank you.